totally just tried that. I've seen it on, where did I see it? It doesn't matter. Anyways, Jackson was wanting to blow off the driveway because they want to play basketball. I was like, hey, while we got that out, why don't you try blowing out the van? It worked pretty good. Do you think it worked good, Jackson? Better than sweeping it? And it like got in, you know, the nooks and crannies of the seat. So there you go. Get a, <laughs> we opened up the back doors and the side door and just blew out. All... We still had sand from the beach. So that worked out good, huh? Yep. You didn't know that you were getting, having to do that much work. So we're doing a project day. <laughs> We've got some tables that we want to redo. And a chair. Yeah, and a chair. So this has actually been, I've wanted to do this thing forever. It was my grandma's and my mom gave it to me whenever I moved out of the house. And I've just had a piece, like a tea towel on top. So we're finally gonna do this to get it ready for our new house, cause I still don't wanna get rid of it. So hopefully get all this veneer off and then stain the top and then paint the base. And then I got this table for the girls' room gonna paint at an antique store. White and stain the top. Yeah, so they want to do the same thing. So that'll be cute. And Taylor can put all of her books in there. <laughs> so I have been wanting to do that table, the red one, for like years and years. And it just is something that I never took the time to do. I've always thought about it. And I've been like thinking of things that I want to get rid of, things that I want to keep. I'm going to be getting rid of a lot. I'm keeping a lot too, though. I have a problem y'all <laughs> anyways but i was i was gonna get rid of that red chest is what we call it like we'll probably still call it the red chest after it's white i was like i just really like it like it's not it is sentimental it was actually my toy chest at my grandma's house whenever i was a little girl but i just really like it i just anyway so i don't want to get rid of it i was like you know what because it's our nightstand in our room i was like it can still work as our nightstand I'm gonna redo it. So we've got nothing better to do, so we're gonna redo some furniture today. <laughs> the older girls were kind of like, we're bored, we're bored, saying some stuff. I was like, do y'all feel like doing some projects? They are like, yeah, so that works out. Many hands make light work. We're also redoing a chair. We're stripping the paint off of that, and that's a much longer process. So it will just be a fun project day of, well, getting started. I'm pretty sure that we won't finish. Hmm. Okay, so I actually found this stuff behind the red chest. I keep, that's where I keep all of our pictures is in the red chest. And this is a picture of Logan. Does that not look like Camden, y'all? I mean, seriously. I've been saying it for a while that Camden is looking more like Logan. But Camden has Taylor's eye shape. But anyways, look at that. And you know what's funny is I have that outfit and Camden has worn it the church. <laughs> I guess it's time to get rid of some stuff, huh? Anyways, but look how baby Logan, little teeth. Although I think he's like 18 months in this picture. I'd have to look at the date. I'm pretty sure. He's like 18 months or 12 months and Camden's nine months now, today. He's nine months old today. Oh so we have worked up an appetite and it's getting hot. We got some uh, sanding done and that veneer is not coming off very easily in some places on those tables that I showed y'all. I will show you what they look like in a little bit. But meanwhile, we are stopping having lunch. The kids have had leftover pizza and sliced pears. I am having a spinach pear, blueberry and goat cheese salad. It is so good. If you haven't had this combination, try it um, with balsamic dressing. But then I also put some sunflower seeds on it too. It is pretty sunny out, but here's kind of like the progress report. So we are, we just stay, or sanded down the top mainly because we're going to stain that and paint the rest. So we just kind of roughed up where we're going to paint, but I think that is good enough. And we have the stain on hand. I don't have the paint. Though. So we're going to go ahead and stain the top on that. This table is proving to be a little bit harder than what I was hoping. And that's, well, partly why I've avoided this project for so long. I never knew what to do with the top. So I just was looking up stuff on YouTube and watching some videos. Somebody said to do a wet towel on top of veneer that's hard to get off. I, I don't know. Worst case, we try to replace the top, but I figured it was worth a shot trying to get it off. So we got a good bit off. It? I put a wet towel. It's supposed to help loosen the veneer. So we're gonna let this sit for a little bit. But I kind of wanted this top because it just looks rustic. And we gouged some of it, but it's a good thing I like the rustic look, huh? <laughs> um, so we will see. Hopefully, we can finish the top. Y'all, do y'all remember Pogs? Tell me I'm not alone in this. <laughs> Goodness, my makeup has kind of melted down my face some, huh? Give me just a second. <laughs> oh, we've been outside working on the tables, and it, it's hot. I think 
we're close to done for the day. Anyways, but do y'all remember Pogs, okay? So that red chest is full of pictures. So I've been reminiscing, pulling out tons of pictures, showing them to the kids. There's pictures of Nathan and I, like at my senior prom. I should go get those and show, though, show that to you. Anyways, but my Pogs are in there. <laughs> I don't know why I never got rid of these. I had a glow-in-the-dark slammer. I mean, I was cool, y'all. Let me just tell you. Magic 8-ball. Anyways, oh my goodness. <laughs> I think I can get rid of these. Oh, I do have Winnie the Pooh, Pog. So do y'all remember these? Tell me I'm not alone. My kids think I'm crazy. I have pulled them out in the past and taught them how to play them and stuff like that. That was a while ago. I should probably do that with maybe Logan. But anyways, let me find those prom pictures again and I'll show you Nathan and Jessica at my senior prom. Here we are, my senior prom. So I'm doing this in the schoolroom because the lighting was better. This is our painted table in our schoolroom. Many art projects have happened here, so that's what all the paint swatches are. Anyways, but that is me. No, this isn't senior. This is junior year. Yes. Wow. Look, I got braces and everything. <laughs> junior year. Nathan and I started dating in 2000 and one no yeah 2001 so we've been together since my junior year still going strong y'all but look oh my goodness so young so skinny my word <laughs> it's like one of those projects that you start but you spend more time reminiscing through old pictures and old things than you do actually working on the project i mean kind of knew that was going to happen cleaning out my room because i've got a lot of a lot of sentimental stuff Y'all, I am such a mess. Look, I've got salad dressing stained on my shirt. Still trying to work on this table. This portion is not coming up so easily. I, I saw a trick on YouTube as well of trying an iron with a damp towel. So I think I will try that next. But again, I can still replace the top. But if I just put another tea towel on top of it, like nobody's gonna know what's underneath there. <laughs> so I may just do that. Just do sand it down the best that I can and paint the base. Nobody's gonna know. Nobody looks under tea towels, right? All right, done with projects for now. The next project at hand is dinner. So I actually had chicken cooking in the Instapot while we were busy doing all the other things. So I got that shredded up. So I put three, so I think it was just over three pounds of chicken that I cooked. So three and a half cups um, of the shredded chicken I put in here. We're gonna have chicken pot pie tomorrow, or tonight. And then tomorrow, I'm gonna use the rest of the chicken and I'll probably do like chicken taquitos or something like that. But, so getting dinner started. We actually are going to church tonight. So I've got to get this going. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I mean, toddlers, right? Like that's kind of hilarious. Can we do that? <laughs> I had this simmering, <laughs> well not simmering, I was melting, I'm telling y'all, I'm a mess today. I was melting the cream cheese on the chicken. Anyways, I started burning it. I got it in time, y'all, I got it. I was getting too focused on washing dishes. No, we still don't have her dishwasher. Enough said, right? Okay. So, Nathan came home from work and he sees the, the table out there. He's like, you have waited how many years? And now you're working on this table? It's like it seemed like a perfect time to me. <laughs> Anyways, it was just funny. He's like, I don't know that that's veneer on top. I was like, I thought it was. He's like, it looks like wood. So I don't know what I'm doing, but we're, we're going with it and we're figuring it out one step at a time. So in my chicken pot pie, um, I actually doubled the vegetables. I, I kind of, I don't really double the meat. I think it calls for a pound of meat. So I guess I do. I don't know. I double the vegetables, okay? Try to get it to stretch. I have been adding more meat than what I used to. Um, but anyway, so I gotta get this simmering. Logan actually has football practice tonight, so Nathan's gonna take him and then meet the rest of the kids and I at church. So, oh, <laughs> like, I gotta get myself cleaned up and presentable for church. <laughs> All right, we're gonna let this simmer and let the vegetables cook some. I wonder if I should add some more chicken broth. It seems a little thick. Maybe I will. Let me turn that up. Okay, while that's simmering, one of on today's video that went out was us announcing that we have closed on the land and so many congratulations and well wishes and prayers for the zoning issue that we are still facing. Thank you very much. It, one step at a time. <laughs> so I have the good moments and bad moments with it. 
of borderline freaking out, but I'm just, I'm just trusting the process right now. And Nathan, because he's like, I really feel like this is what we should do. So I'm just going with it. So anyways, <laughs> in that video, I had mentioned about cutting the grass because it's five acres of mostly cleared land. Okay. There's a good bit of trees, but the grass has gotten pretty tall. And then it was like, we are looking into, you know, how we've got to maintain it until we purchase something ourselves. I've been looking at, you know, what we should even get. I don't know. It's all expensive. Anyways, it was funny because on that video, my point, get to the point, Jessica, one of y'all commented and said, you, you need to get a scythe. And I was like, is that what that thing is called? Like I knew what she was referring to but I just didn't know what it was called. So we love watching like Little House on the Prairie and the Love Comes Softly series. And that's what they're out there using in the yard, right? <laughs> or in the prairie, in the pasture, whatever. Um, I guess the animals would eat the pasture. Y'all following me? So I looked up a picture of an antique scythe that I've been teasing Nathan. I'm like, so this is how we're gonna maintain the land. And he's like, um, no. Anyways, I just thought that was pretty funny. <laughs> A lot like Kimberly. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so chicken pot pie is all done. We serve it with white uh, rice. This looks like we Kimberly. got some hungry people. Yes, yeah, so and this that's Taylor. It is, it's Taylor. So we found an old photo calendar that was in that <laughs> chest, too. Look. <laughs> okay. Look at that. All right, y'all ready to eat? Sure. Yeah. No. It's Sunday. It's not Sunday. <laughs> <laughs> it's Wednesday. Yes. You look so cute to go to youth group. Very pretty. I like your hair. I feel like I look like Ramona from Ramona and Beezus when she got her hair curled. No, that's cute. Very cute. Okay, so we're ready to hit the road. Stop. All right. <laughs> got the kitchen all cleaned up. Did not, I said, well. Got the kitchen mostly cleaned up. Did not get to the dishes, but they're not going anywhere unless some magic dish fairy does them while we're gone. <laughs> One can dream, right? Anyway, so we, okay, yeah. So we're gonna load up and go. I just wanted to close out the video before we left for church because I would probably forget. So thanks for hanging out with us today and kind of seeing my nostalgic reminiscent of old pictures and getting some projects started, not finished, but. We gotta start somewhere. So thanks so much for hanging out with us and we'll see you on the next video.